Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to use auto hotkey for Roblox. Before we start, hurry up and check out these out for just on this video. So let's get started. So you might be wondering how do you use auto hotkey here with Roblox if you want to use it. Well, this one is actually pretty easy. So first things first is you want to install or get auto hotkey here. So go to google.com, search auto hotkey, and you should, get a set, uh, you should get the first thing here. Let's open it up. Now, in here, what we need to do is you want to go ahead and download the installer. So let's just wait for this to verify us and just go ahead and click on the download button. Now, from here, just go ahead and click on download. And from here, just go ahead and choose the V2 here since the latest one that we could get. And it should start to initiate the download. And as you can see, it's now downloading. So let's just wait for it to fully finish downloading. Let's go open up the folder. And what we need to do next is we just need to double click on the auto hotkey setup.exe file. And from here, you want to go and specify where you want to download this. Now, let's go and click on install. Now, by the way, you can change this, but I would recommend you to just keep it as is. Let's go and click on install. Click on yes if it requires further permission. And we just need to wait for it to uh, finish downloading. Now, from here, what we need to do next is we need to set a few things here. So, in this case, you want to go and click on new script. And you can just add a title for that script by the way this is where it's going to be the uh busy saved so let's just say this is going to be a test script obviously you could use whatever name you want let's go and click on create and from here it's going to open up that specific script here now what you need to do is you want to right click on it and you want to go and click on open with and by the way if you don't see the one i'm going to show you just use choose another app and scroll down a bit here and choose notepad and just click on just once or always depending on what you need and in here what we need to do is we just need to add our script so whatever your uh whatever you want to do here so i added some text here or in this case simple script uh which in this case what it does is if you're using the wsd uh, movement here this actually replaces the AWSD movement to a JKLI movement. So if like, for example, if your W key is broken, it's not working properly, there's a great way for you to basically uh, use alternative keys uh, just in case you want to use it. But yeah, so once you're done, you just need to make sure that you save this. Let's go ahead and save this one, close it. And you want to go ahead and just double click on it. And so in this case, it looks like the script are trying to run the course auto hotkey v1, which not, is not installed. So in this case, you may need to, depending on how you set this up, you may need to install auto hotkey of version 1 here. So in this case, you're going to click on yes. Click on yes. In this case, downloading auto hotkey here. And just wait for it to download. But once it's actually done, you should be able to run it. It's now installed. It's going to click on OK. And from here, it's going to double click again, so see if it's run. And in this case, we can close this one. Let's go and double click on this one. The install script is already running. So it means it's already running. So at the bottom right here, you should see uh, auto hotkey running in the background. So in this case, it's now active. So you could just open a Roblox here and start using it. But yeah, so in this case, uh, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.